Welcome back at 641. If you're looking for a hands-on educational activity for the entire family this weekend, the MSU Archaeology Program is digging up quite the experience for you. There you go, the three-month-long series showing the public how to dig up artifacts from the past. And to tell us more about this special series, Francesca is live in East Lansing at the MSU Museum with the creator of the program, Greg. Good morning, guys. I've actually become an honorary archaeologist this morning. I was going ahead and I was digging away in that last season, if you uh, saw that. But first, to tell us just about some archaeology artifacts that they found around MSU is Adrian. Now, you told me that MSU Campus Archaeology found these that we see on the table, Adrian. Absolutely. Um, these are all excavated from campus. Um, these, for example, are artifacts from the very first dorm yeah. on campus that are about 150 years old. Now tell them what you're holding because that creeped me out. <laughs> this is a piece of butchered bone that would have been uh, from maybe a cow that was eaten by some of the first students on campus. Gosh, and then I know that there was an inkwell as well, probably 150 years old maybe. Uh, something, something about that. This is from People's Park, which is a park that's near campus. Now let's go over here because I want to talk about what the kids, what the adults will be able to do on Saturday for this series that you guys got going on here. Let's get deep into this. <laughs> <laughs> What's the technique being used? Well, we're, we're excavating artifacts, and so what we want to do is dig very carefully and slowly to reveal what we have oh. buried in the dirt here. So we use our brushes and our trowels to dig carefully around the artifacts. Perfect. And you are doing very good at it. Thank you so much. I'm trying to brush away. Well, again, the all of the information for this event that begins tomorrow or that continues tomorrow is on our website, uh, and it also continues into April, I believe. Yep, we have events on tomorrow, the 22nd, um, March 22nd, and April 5th, which is actually part of Science Well, this will be a great educational event for the entire family. Thanks again, Adrian. Back to you guys in the studio.